Police say a former Bishop Chittard student has made another threat against the school. This one could send him back to jail. Parents of students are asking questions about security at the school. News 8's Angelie Cockaday is here to tell us about the new threats and the school's decision to keep the doors open. Angelie? Good morning, Drew and Scott. That former student is 20-year-old Hunter Wollever. He already faces criminal charges for two threats. Now he's been ordered to show up in court Friday to answer allegations of a third threat. Wish TV was there yesterday as deputies served the court order against Wollever. The school claims Wollever posted a violent threat on social media Monday night, the third such threat within a month. He had been ordered to have no contact with the school after his arrest last month. Wollever told detectives he posted the original threats to make school administrators, administrators and other former students feel uncomfortable. The first two threats forced the school to cancel classes on campus. This week, the school held classes despite the posting. The, this, we've done uh, everything that we believe is necessary to provide this, the safety and security uh, uh, for all of our students, faculty and staff, um, regardless of his status. I kind of go back to the authorities, Marion County, the police, the prosecutors, do their job. I mean, if, you know, if he's such a big threat, they need to do something. Despite, despite some concern, the president said the school can't live day by day worrying about where he is. Willever does have an ankle monitor. The president also said it's the school's hope that Willever gets the help he needs, and he's asking all communities to pray for him. A judge could decide Friday to hold Willever in contempt of court, which could lead to new sanctions against him. The judge could also order him back to jail. I'm Angela Cockaday. Back to you. Angela, thank you.